Howdy, this is David Moore for Photoshop CS6. In this video, I'd like to show you how to access our Middle Eastern features, allowing you to type Arabic and Hebrew in your Photoshop documents. To get started, we have to access our preferences found on Mac under Photoshop, Preferences, and in Windows under Edit Preferences. Come down to Type, and you'll notice beginning with CS6, we have a new option here, Choose Text Engine. Click Middle Eastern. This text engine supports not just Arabic and Hebrew, but also Latin-based scripts such as English, French, German, and Finnish, Cyrillic-based scripts such as Russian and Ukrainian, Greek, and has some support for Japanese, Chinese, and Korean. Notice, changes will take effect the next time you start Photoshop. So click OK, close Photoshop, and relaunch. Once Photoshop has relaunched, you'll notice your character and paragraph panels haven't changed. That's because while we've changed the text engines, we actually have not enabled the additional features. To do so, click Type, Language Options, and Middle Eastern Features. You'll now notice both the character and paragraph panels have grown to accommodate the icons for this additional functionality. So let's create a new document and add a type layer to it. On this type layer, you can type whatever you'd like, such as the classic, Hello World. And you'll notice nothing's changed. That's because the type engine for Arabic and Hebrew supports pretty much all the same functionality as the conventional type engine. You ask, however, how do I type Arabic and Hebrew? So you have to change your keyboard. In this case, I'll choose an Arabic keyboard. But because Arabic is a language written right to left, I will also change the flow of my text from left to right to right to left. This allows me to now type Marhaba! Kif? Kif Alec! Howdy, how are you? I could just as easily change my keyboard to Hebrew and type. Toda! Thank you, and thank you for watching this video.